What's going on, YouTube people out there, wherever you live? That's one thing I'd like to know. If you could leave me a comment below if you watched this video, even just this one part, let me know if you're from the United States, if you're from Texas or Ohio or wherever you're from, from whatever country, from whatever city. I'm interested to know because I always get surprised when I'm like, oh, this person's not from the United States because I guess people from the United States think that we're so cool because we are not really. I'm lying. I'm lying. So I want to know what your biggest pet peeve is. Because I've noticed that really weird things bother me. Like when I try and do dishes with someone else or clean a room with someone else, I literally am incapable. Because when someone else is trying to help me do something, I know that I'm totally capable of doing myself. I just like, I can't handle them trying to help me. I don't know why, even though they're just being nice. Not even like they're talking down to me like I can't do it myself, just that they're trying to help me out. I don't know. But it's always been a thing of mine that I can't let someone help me when I can do it myself because I have my own way of doing things. And if someone messes with that or if I see someone doing it the wrong way, and by the wrong way I mean not my way, then I just go insane. And then another pet peeve is when someone tries to get attention by saying something really weird just so you can be like, oh, you said something really weird, and they're like, <laughs> I know, I'm just so crazy. Sorry, the dorm I live in is right across the street from this huge bell. So every 15 minutes, that bell goes off. I'm kind of surprised it hasn't gone off during one of my videos before. So as I was saying, when, you know, someone does something crazy, and they're like, I'm crazy. Could you even imagine? Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, that drives me insane. Other things that drive me crazy. Like, I've always thought about making a list of things that annoy me so that later on I can reference it and be like, oh yeah, actually that does annoy me. Because when you sit there and think about it, I think it's, it's difficult for me personally to think about the things that bother me. But when they happen, it's like, oh, nails on the chalkboard. Which you never really hear. So it's kind of interesting that everyone knows what that sounds like. I wanted to show you these cute little paintings that my boyfriend's little sisters did for me. Look at how cute that is! Oh wait, it's backwards for you guys. Well, that's supposed to say Joey. Joey. Sorry, I'm using photo booth right now instead of using my camera because it's just easier to everything. Um, but I have it switched so that when I raise my right hand, it's like I'm looking in a mirror and my right hand is raised rather than with iMovie whenever I record an iMovie it's the other way like this would be my right hand and that would be weird to me so when I show you this photo this this lovely painting this says Joey I'm going from left to right not from right to left um, and then this one is so cute and these were actually both done by his um, sister Rachel who is nine years old so cute, so precious. I love it. It's right above my pillow on my bed. I'm also going to do my shout outs in this video. Two shout outs for today. And anyone who subscribes after this video is posted. I will do a shout out to you tomorrow. Actually, about shout outs, what do you guys think about shout outs? So I'm thinking about doing shout outs to people who actually upload videos and then just like writing down the names of my new subscribers on a piece of paper that don't do videos and just kind of like making it a mini shout out that way the people who actually make videos and are trying to get um, some subscribers can get um, can get that attention and then I can just like kind of show the subscribers who don't put up videos that they're still appreciated because I do I appreciate all of my subscribers I actually don't think I've ever said that, but seriously, like, putting vlogs up on YouTube 
doesn't really matter unless you have people watching them, I guess. I mean, it does matter because it's awesome to look back at what you've done, like, later on. This will be really cool, like, in a year. I can look back at this video and be like, wow, I'm so freaking cool. Oh, yeah. But seriously, like, subscribers and even people who don't subscribe, but just people who watch your videos every day, they mean so much to, I mean, it means so much to me. I don't know about other people who put up videos, if they even really care. But that's actually kind of a reason why I don't do sub for sub. Because I believe that you should earn your subscribers. And that I'm not going to subscribe to someone unless I really like like their videos. Um, will be willing to watch them every day. Like, if you subscribe to me and I don't subscribe to you, no offense. That's just the, re the way I roll. So... Yeah, I think I'm going to start doing that new, like, if you don't post a video, subscriber thing. So, be watching out for that. Plus, I think I'm just going to put my shoutouts in my video of the day every day. So that people don't have to watch a new video for shoutouts. And it can kind of catch them by surprise. Like, oh, I'm watching a Megan vlog, blah, blah, blah. Oh, look at this, shoutouts. I'm going to go check out this cool person that she's shouting out to. That's the way it should work. That's what gets you more subscribers than me just so than me just subscribing to you. So here are my shout outs for today. Alright, subscriber number 14 is Benzy T. He is right here. Right here. He's 14 years old and a part of YouTube Orbit, so you should definitely check him out because YouTube Orbit people are awesome which means he puts up vlogs so you should go check those out definitely and subscriber number 15 is droid fan uh, 2010 um, I would just like to make a note that it says sub for sub at the top of your page and I'm gonna check out your videos later so I might subscribe to you I might not no offense to you if you saw the part of the video before this you will understand so here's your shout out hopefully you get some subscribers right here droid fan 2010 he has vlogs up and only has 10 subscribers so you should go subscribe to him if you like his videos go check him out right here right here those are my shout outs for today and I don't have much more of a video to do so you don't have to see my face anymore later